I just wanted to give you a quick update on the latest changes and updates to Fusion HQ. As you can see, we have a new dashboard interface for the home page. When you log in, you'll be able to see the last income statistics for the past eight weeks, your last opt-ins for the past four weeks, the last 10 sales, and your top performing five products and top performing five affiliates as well as seeing the total number of affiliates, total number of products, and the total number of sales. Now, as you can see, this is a test account, so we don't have any data in here. On the right-hand side, we have a Fusion Updates box. This is a live feed from Facebook, which you can see the latest changes as we make them. Under the Processes tab, we still have the same um, upsell, downsell processes system with simple drag and drop simplicity. This allows you to add pages or edit pages. As you can see, my computer's a little slow as I'm in Thailand, so please forgive me. However, one of the new updates is we also now have fixed pages. Fixed pages allows you to have a series of um, static pages, such as contact us, uh, about us, disclaimer, terms and conditions, etc., that you may want within your sales process. Now, when we're editing a page, one of the new features we have is the drag and drop editor. So if we want to create, for example, um, a headline, perhaps we can just go in and we can double click and have headline. And just center that and then we can choose headline style okay now we're happy with our headline we can insert for example just some text and again we can just enter whatever text we want here and click OK now maybe we want to add an opt-in box so all we do is grab the opt-in box, drag it over. Now, as you can see, we have to have an opt-in form created. So we'll just choose one here and we'll just choose the connection link. OK, then we can choose our design. Um, OK, and then we can go to the next step, choose our button, next step, edit any text that we want within the edit, uh, within the opt-in box and click apply and just make that the correct size. Um, now what we're able to do is move the boxes around a little bit and let's say we want this to go to the side then we just resize it and we can just move it up and place it in here. Um, so as you can see it's very easy just to edit um, a page and move the data around on the page. You can insert pictures, buy now buttons, no thank you buttons, etc. This makes it really, really easy for creating a sales page. We want to add some blank space in here. We can add some blank space and if you want to make it smaller, just resize it. Um, so it's, it's really fast to create a sales page now um, and you don't need any coding knowledge at all, as you can see. Uh, if we want to create a split test, then we simply copy A to B, yes, and click OK, and now we have a split test running, and now we can make edits to our headline, and OK, now that's all done. Now you see we have split test A, split test B, and both are ticks, so both are live, and we can just click Save. Once you've done this, all you'll need to do is click um, Close, and direct upload and it'll make it live to your website. Now some of the other new features. Um, we now have a membership site system and so you're able to create uh, entire membership websites using the same drag and drop uh, simplicity. You can just add new pages and edit pages. Now the great thing about this is that if you edit a page um, you have to excuse this rather bad um, test page that I've opened up here, but um, if we go into options, you're able to simply decide 
if you want it a public access page or a private access page. If it's private, what membership levels are able to get access to this page? And then you're able to delay the page if you wish. So if you're doing a microcontinuity based membership program, then just simply enter the number of days delay here and this page will not appear in the membership area for that person um, before, before that date. Now, if you click on a particular module, you also have the option to show that each one of these page elements can also be defined by just a product owner or a membership site, uh, a members owner. So only certain people with certain products can actually view certain pieces on the page. This allows you to create download pages for everybody but only people who have bought particular products will be able to get access to the downloads of those products. There's m multiple ways you can use this. And Okay, just quickly moving along. Um, uh, we also have domain hosting now. So you're able to add a domain. Um, pro users will get one free domain and hosting. So this is a pro level option. Um, so this enables you to register domain names with us, have them automatically set up to our server and set up to the shared hosting, which you can then use. Um, so you don't need to set up uh, or repoint DNS name servers. You don't have to um, try to open uh, set up your cPanel, add domain names in cPanel, etc, etc. Everything can just be done with one click from within here. We have our affiliate system now. Um, we've made some extra changes in here and now have uh, mass pay and a whole pile of other additional features. So if you're trying to run your affiliate program then this is a great place to do it. If you use ClickBank then we're actually able to use, you're able to use the affiliate system within Fusion to manage your ClickBank affiliates. So you can create tools for your ClickBank affiliates, etc., in here and then send them to your um, Fusion affiliate page and they can get access to all of their, their links pre populated with their affiliate link, their ClickBank affiliate link. We've just added an autoresponder. Um, and at the moment this is in beta, this is going to go through some big changes coming shortly, but you're able to do big broadcasts um, like newsletter broadcasts, etc. Or you can create an autoresponder follow-up series. Now the great thing about the Fusion um, autoresponder is because it's integrated with your sales process, you're able to decide exactly who to send to. You can create sublists based on who has bought or who has not bought, who has signed up to certain lists, who has not signed up to certain lists or to contact your affiliates. Um, we've also expanded our tutorials section now. So we have additional tutorials um, to help you understand the whole system far better. And for those of you who haven't seen yet, we also have the switch to affiliate mode. So if you're using Fusion as an affiliate or you wish to promote uh, another Fusion member's product, then you just simply switch to affiliate mode and then you can see which campaigns you're currently promoting, the sales, the commissions, etc. And you can go into Marketplace to um, find products to promote. And we can just switch back to vendor mode. So hopefully that's been a useful update for you of the new features, etc. I hope you have fun playing around. Um, and keep an eye out for the next lot of updates within Fusion HQ.